Yeah, greetings. Um, good morning. And today, um, you know, we're going to try to do a, 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 a full day program on how I function in terms of eating. Um, everybody wants to know what I want to have, what I, what, what I do have for breakfast, what I have for lunch, and a so called dinner. I don't have dinner anyway, so we're we, we doing one meal or two meals per day, yeah? All right? I always have a blender and I always have a juicer. So, um, morning time, we do teas, you know. Um, this is where I sun. Sea moss, boil the sea moss with some cinnamon, ginger. And we put some pipwisa, some other plants, some golden seal, or some olive leaf extract in here. That's my tea, right? And then we can use this as the base for a smoothie we're going to make. And that's going to keep me around this time of the day, 12 o'clock, right? All right, then we have the jelly from the coconut, you know, um, and, and that's going to be the breakfast, the breakfast, because we're not supposed to eat at night, all right? And... Come over here, son, son. Come, come. Come. And this here is going to be my lunch about um, 3, 4 o'clock, and that's it for the day. All right, that's it. It's all cool in here now with onions, um, lots of garlic, lots of green peppers, yellow peppers, pumpkin with the skin on, and some peas, you know? Yeah? All right. Come here, son. So, that's how I function. And that's what I give with all my cancer patients too, so they can alkaline in the blood, right? Um, so we go in coconut water, don't forget the coconut water is your base. And we don't have no coconut water over here in, in the boxes, so it has to be fresh. If you keep the coconut water outside, it's going to spoil, all right? Because we don't have no preservatives. And then we have our coconut jelly here, we're going to put that in there too. And what I do is I soak the sea moss overnight, and then I will get the sea moss. See, have a sea moss like this over here, yeah, and then um, soak it overnight. It comes like this over here, and then we could take and we could throw it in here too in the blender, you know, everything in the blender with the coconut water, you know, you know, and um, and if you like, you can put a little bit of your tea in the blender too, a little bit of your tea, and this have also sea moss in there. To go to, 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 to soothe the stomach walls and to soothe the lung tissue, you know. And then what I do, I use holy immune is very significant to me. I use a lot of holy immune um, because this is made by a cancer specialist, Dr. Jeffrey Downs. He's an oncologist, and he 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 made this product to help to detoxify your liver and to build up the immune, keep the immune system healthy. So I put a scoop of that, and then I will use my protein. As I said before, I would use my proteins in the morning time. So that by 12 o'clock my proteins are gone. But the protein have to be they're building food, but it could be they 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 they're also toxemia food. But this is plant-based protein. And I might use a little bit of that, put it in here. Yeah. So you have your protein. And <laughs> some chlorophyll to clean up the system in the, your, your intestines and also keep the pH in your intestine at 7.8. Chlorophyll. All right, keep it, have it good bread too. You know, you don't have no, no, um, no bad bread, you know? Yeah? And then I put a, a teaspoon of black seed powder. I don't use the oil. I use the powder. And I use the uh, one teaspoon, uh, half a teaspoon maybe of the powder. Yeah? Inside it, don't forget black seed powder. I don't use the black seed oil at all. Then I use to keep my thyroid gland, which is part of the endocrine system. I put, I put 40 drops of the thyroid. I made this formula for myself to keep my thyroid healthy. I use mother's wort, lemon balm, you know, some uh, seaweeds, I kelp and bladder rat, and also some sea moss. Then I have one for my circulation. See, keep my circulatory system moving and preventing plaque from forming on the walls of my arteries so I don't get, you know, clogging of the arteries and then I put 40 drops of that in there then I use one to keep my eyes healthy, nothing wrong with my eyes but I try to keep my eyes healthy so I put something called inside compound 
in there with bilberry and babla, blueberry and you know lyceum fruit and I threw that 40 drops in there too and then I put one to build up my cells keep my cells healthy my cells and my blood keep the blood moving and keep the cells well this is called a cell and blood builder and that's what I do that's what I make myself I make it on my own to keep my cells healthy with Romania and you know all these other plants that build the blood chick man chickweed and all these other plants you know build the blood up yeah and then what I will do these is from the men's multi by rainbow light uh, it's plant-based all right before the critics come and say it's all you know, pharmaceutical it's a plant base with lots of vegetables and I don't like to pop too much pills but these two is from a prostate gland to keep my prostate healthy because we notice that a lot of our young brothers now is suffering from prostate cancer and dying from the disease at the age of even 49 and 50, 60, 61, whereby it never used to happen before. I have to swallow those because they are, because they are, because they are gels. These are the trichardia to, keep my, to clean up my cardiovascular system um, to keep the blood moving a little well and prevent plaque from forming on the walls. But if there is kind of plaque in the walls, there is, it cleans it up, EDT. You know, I don't make no joke. And then... I use two of these here. It's called PB8, and PB8 means probiotic 8. And the probiotic 8 have about 40 billion of the probiotics in there. I don't swallow these. I will take them and I'll put them inside the blender, you know. I don't like to swallow too much pills. You know, that's the natural from the plant base, you know what I mean? And then I have one here for circulation. Um, it has cayenne pepper, vitamin E. Uh, cayenne pepper, vitamin E and horton leaf and flour um garlic too kylie garlic aged garlic and i put i might uh, put two of these in here too yeah and most of all magnesium is very important for the muscles heart muscle good for the nerves good for the brain um so magnesium is very important to keep the pressure your high blood your, your, your heart functioning properly and I will um, use about 1,200 milligrams of magnesium per day, every day, uh, to keep my heart pumping well and keep my pressure down and I'll normalize my nerve function, my brain function. Yeah? And I will do that and let's blend these up. And this, these, this here is for when the temperature is hot, around 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, my avocado, so you can burn because you need, you need heat. To burn fats up so when I eat this I eat it around 12 the temperature is hot one o'clock the temperature is hot take a little walk I burned the fat up so you don't have a fatty liver don't forget you know what I mean let me blend this up No sugar, sea moss, ginger, cinnamon in here, and I put a little bit here to make it a little bit more. Yeah, you see how thick it is? It's thick, a little thick because of the sea moss. And you know, sea moss have a lot of minerals and trace elements, you know what I mean? And then I will um, mix that with here, with this over here now. Yeah, and now I will take the two from my prostate gland. That's my breakfast, my breakfast. This would keep me until 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock. Because the key is to have foods moving from one place, stomach, to intestines at the right pace, the right time. So when this move out of my stomach, I prepare my stomach now at 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock for these foods here. The fats now. 
And after I have the fats, I'm gonna have my soup. I have a three, four o'clock, and that's it for the day. I don't eat nothing after that, or unless I'm gonna have some like liquid teas or coconut water, or again some soup again that would move. So by the time I go to sleep at night, I don't have no food sitting in my earth system to hamper the function of the endocrine glands, to hamper the function of my liver and my pancreas, so they can regenerate at that particular time. I don't have food sitting in my stomach all day, all night, having one food meat and the other one inside here, causing havoc in the organ system and in the blood. See, and that's the way we have to eat in order for us to prevent our children and ourselves from going into these people's institution. You know what I mean? We were taught the wrong way. So once you have your proteins in the morning, you have to know how long the protein takes to move out of the stomach to the intestines. And then you, then you have another meal that you know going to take five, three to four hours. By one o'clock, by five o'clock, it's gone. By six o'clock, you have some liquid, some soup. By seven, eight o'clock, it's gone. By the time you go to bed now, at nine, ten o'clock, your immune system have no way of running to these areas that food is sitting in trying to eh, repair what you are trying to damage in the night time. And that's the key. I mean, so we're going to have a doctor coming in with an ultrasound machine and he's going to teach us how he takes his ultrasound for our liver and see how good the liver is. You're going to take a, 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 an ultrasound of my, of, my, of my abdomen. He did it already on live. You're going to have to happen sometime this week and you're going to understand that it's not only herbal medicine, but you have to work with, with, what, with what allopathic doctors because they act as what I call complementary medicine. I complement them. Right? So until, blessed love and give thanks and praise to the most high. And don't forget to get an appointment. You got to go to Christy Books, K R I S T Y B W K S dot B I Z, or the number is 718 or 414734219604. I hope I gave you all some, um, some, um, some tips on how to keep the food moving from one place to the next so you can stay well. And if you have any disease to repair, once you have the food moving well, you will get better, okay? And don't forget to put in our, now we're gonna put in our what? Our, uh, the meat from the, from the coconut. Yeah, and this here is gonna be given to my, to my cancer patient, you know? You know what I mean? And then, um, after you take this, he's going to be well. And we're going to see how good that how the, the things that God put on the earth to for us to get well, how they function. Give thanks and bless the love and give thanks and praise to the most high Jehovah God. Peace.